doing first off is I'm just making contact with the body and you know just refriending it here. You say. Um, so we want to stay away from the genitals as much as possible, especially guys. Um, women have breasts, and are your breasts particularly sensitive or? I mean, normal. Normal. Okay, good. We tend to basically um, avoid the breasts, um, but you can't quite totally. Um, the places you can give pressure on the, on the body, lots of pressure, are, is here, sorry, um, hip bones, um, this, these parts of your, the, the lower part of the ribs, um, s straight down into the sacrum, I mean, this, uh, not the sacrum, the sternum, and into the ribs from this direction, or this direction. So, I'm going to just do the positions real quick. First positions um, would be facing the head from this side. I can lean into the pelvis this way, and into the guts this way, and into the ribs this way. Facing the feet, kind of the same. Hips. Now I'm getting work on my body by you know putting her ilium right in on the side of my um, waist. And she's getting something here because I'm doing what I what I refer to in the front. I like to call them as layings. Let you lay on them in various ways. Um, so this here gets the genitals. Not that you're focusing on the genitals, but the whole hip gets contacted in, in a nice, pretty safe way. Does this feel safe for you? Yeah. Okay. So I'm going to the other ilium now for my shoulder. I can do a full lay onto the pelvis from this direction. I could have done it from the other direction as well, but I'm just saying more of a lay on facing the feet. You can come upwards and do belly with your own belly. I like one of the nicest things you can do with a friend is just do belly belly. There's one cool thing you can do. Yeah, belly belly. Belly belly is really very like sweet. It's very sweet. Very gentle, very subtle work. Um, and you can do belly belly here. You can do belly belly here. You can do belly belly here. Um, it's a very soft way to work with the front. So again, facing the feet. Now I'm going up, up to her ribs with my ribs. And sometimes it's nice instead of just... I, my lower ribs don't feel so great here. I usually like to kind of cup the ribs on both sides with the arm and my ribs on the other side. So I'm getting her rib rib. I'm doing rib rib here now, just below the breast. And in all these positions, you can, you can rock and roll in ways that feel good. And again, this is facing the feet. Also facing the feet from the head neck approach. This approach here is interesting because it's going to get the chest from this direction. Now, usually when I lay into the upper chest from this direction, I face her feet. So my genitals are not in your face, mm. see? But that's another way to do it. Um, not, it might feel appropriate, I don't know. But here's more coming in from the top to work on the ribs from the top, facing your feet. And what I did just now, you can do on the other side just as well, complete program. Facing the feet, leaning in all the different ways, or facing the head and laying on her in all the different ways. Then there's face, then there's like straight in to the chest, which is sometimes a really good thing to do. Does that feel alright? Mm-hmm. So I'm going a little bit more to this side of my chest rather than straight in because it's a little bit more. Yeah. See, I'm fumbling now. This is the fumbly place. Where you don't know exactly how to do it. You're trying to feel for it. 
outside. How's that? Mm -hmm. Okay, and this is where it's important for me to lay my head down eventually so I can relax my head and neck and find a place that feels good, hopefully, for them and you. Sometimes you can shield your head from hitting their body just by putting your arm in the way and still relaxing your head, rolling a bit. I think a little less pressure. A little less pressure, okay. Anyway, I just want to stay there for a bit. Um, now, if you're a little person, and you've got a big person here, you can sit on their chest. Um, you can sit on their chest straight down, or you can sit on your chest like this. If you're a big person, you can put your ribs right under your hips, right into the sternum. Works really well. Um, that's really about it for the front. It's really simple. You just have to, just these different approaches. Facing the head, facing the feet, leaning in, rolling up and down, opening up the chest. Um, one cool thing, sit up for just a minute. Yeah, it's come back down now. You can go like this, and you can get into the chest as well. You're, you're, this is a, oh, down a little bit further. You can do a pincher, a pincher kind of thing between your hip and my upper body. <laughs> you can really mm. give them a good squeeze. This is very effective. You can also um, bring this can slide down. You can bring this into a little bit of a There we go. Move your hips that way a little bit. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Relax. You can get into the chest here too. When you're doing contact improv, these things happen. And um, positions where basically she, she's in my lap. And when a person is in your lap, you have a lot of control over them. Um, and sometimes when they're in your lap, you can um, you know, get them in between your leg and your Mm -hmm. Your leg, your leg, and your hips. Huh? Okay, let's quit. Here's a fun thing. I'm just going to do this real simple. This is a great body work move that you body workers will love to do someday. Sit up really close to their shoulder. Put this over here. Give me this arm. Let's see. Put this over here. Now give me your head. And then you lay back, you flip yourself underneath them, and then you've got them like that. Mm. You can lean into them, mess around with them this way. Anyway, this is a fun way to work on the upper back and the chest. Now, be a little bit of a rag doll here, and I'm going to slowly move, okay? This is gonna put her body <clears throat> into this uh, pincher-like area here in a slightly different way. So I'm just wiggling her around. Oh, see, I got her now, see that? Mm -hmm. Now, when you're in this position, you can twist. You can turn in that position any way you want. Why don't you slowly turn? See, at, any, at any point, keep going. At any point, I can, I, I've got her, see? Right here. You keep turning. Sorry. Oh, that's a good one right there. Oh. Mm. And it's not always perfect how you disengage, but you know, you just dump the bottom slowly. <laughs> 
I just dumped you. So, um, that's it. And cut. <laughs> <laughs>